Alex in Paraguay writes, Paul, thank you for answering all the weird stuff <laughs> that we send daily. <laughs> you're certainly welcome. Hey, here's my question. I'm sure you're aware of the Japanese brand AccuPhase, and I am a wonderful brand, and their motto of accurate phase, and is that the most important factor in audio? Now, is it really that important? Well, I can say AccuPhase, great Japanese brand, been around forever, they make really good stuff. I have a great deal of admiration for them. I wasn't aware that their name, Accurate Phase, had anything to do with their general philosophy, but hey, if they do, that's, I'm just unaware of it. Phase is very important in high-end audio or in any kind of audio system to some degree. So let's talk about what differences phase makes. And I know I'm going to get a lot of flack for this, but if I take the absolute phase or the polarity of these speakers and I flip the phase 180 degrees out of sync, if you will, there aren't that many people around that are going to notice that. If you just walked into this room and I had these speakers out of phase, not with each other, but this one and this one flipped, I don't think many people are going to come in. I don't think I could come in here and tell you that I thought it was out of phase. I'm pretty sure I couldn't. There used to be a guy who was all about that and could, and, and maybe he could hear that. I, I don't know. I would just say the average person cannot hear that. And, and the reason for that is that that is a consistent change in phase. Where we start hearing phase differences is when we get phase shift within the audio band. And that is not something that we wouldn't hear. We, in fact, would hear that depending on where it is. Not so much in the low frequencies, but as the frequencies get higher, the phase honesty, the phase accuracy becomes more and more important. As let's say you get above a certain frequency, if, it, if the phase starts shifting uh, and especially if it becomes erratic and it's not just this nice tapered slope, it, if it becomes erratically out of phase at the point of a crossover for these, not these speakers, but for you know speakers that someone didn't pay a lot of attention to, you'll hear differences in imaging, you'll hear differences in sometimes even in tonality, but, and it really affects the image. So that's the biggest place that I hear phase anomalies, but it can wreak all kinds of havoc. So yeah, phase is really important. But I would also add that in my experience, most reasonably well-designed pieces of electronics within a reasonable band of the audio spectrum are pretty phase accurate. I haven't seen too many pieces of electronics that have major phase problems. Uh, you, you see it at the extremes. If we start rolling off the bass, you're gonna have phase shift out of the bottom end, you'll see it at the top end, but generally, pretty phase accurate. Where you see it is in speakers and in their crossovers. And there, the speaker designer has to really know what they're doing to make sure that doesn't interfere with what we're hearing. But hope that helps. All right, thanks for the question. Talk to you later. Bye.